Good morning, everyone. This is Martin here coming to you live at Facebook, the breakfast show, Money Talk with Smart Ruby. I'm your host, Martin Wong here. Now, how is everybody doing right now? Now, we hope that uh, the last night was more of a call that the Dow Jones can actually go higher. I was expecting it for, to, for it to turn. and But we all know last night, I think Dow went up almost uh, 550 over points and that was a slight uptake by our local market but if not we are seeing a bit of profit taking and i'm going to give you a bit of update on those rubber glove stock that's right now rubber glove has a bit of tension yesterday and we will look at it and also don't forget there are a few things we want to talk about and do we have a great show for you now hope that uh, you could share this video in your timeline or as a story if you find the information that we pass on are beneficial to you and you can make money i think you can right i think omisti remember omisti we talked about on monday hey that one finally moved i always kind of worry you know some of the stocks that we talk about in premium alert doesn't move up and somehow i feel a bit embarrassed recommending you those stocks or more like trade ideas but then again there is a tutorial uh, i will show you which tutorial you can go and take a look at it i've been flashing it over the last few days but hopefully you can find those tutorial help you or not but if you want to take it to the next level definitely we have a master class which is coming up uh, slightly in a month's time you can look on the right hand side there is a contact number you can find out more about our master class but don't forget smart Roby until today is still free available uh, you can download from the Google Play Store and Apple Play Store and do share it with your friend so you can get the extra credit that's right 200 credit when you can uh, share with your friend now let's look at the klci now and let's move on to our story this morning in here All right so our first story for the morning is no other than aha oil and gas that's right now oil and gas we all know has been in sort of the lime lab and usually newspaper the age or the star will tend to play it as the oil prices move up, right? We've seen oil prices as analysts are predicting around the 45 to 50 dollars. So you can see in here the average tapis price, which is you know more like you know it's really going down to the 30 over dollars as a result, you know what can we say, a number of contracts are, because it's a supply and demand thing, right? It's the same as what we talked about yesterday, the FCPO2, right? When there are demands for more crude oil for cooking, then we'll see more growth of this, okay? Ah, nah, okay, there was an answer here, Alan asked, uh, D-Pharma flu a few minutes ago, we will cover those at the 9.30 uh, session on uh, tomorrow night, the stock review and, and also our stock analysis. This one, we focus more of the headlines, the KLSC, so you can analyze it from a top-down effect. Now, also, uh, what this thing talks about is, do we take it slow now with all the oil and gas player, Dialog, Dayang and Heisbiscus, because these are one of those very highly rated by Smart Roby. So something we want to take a look at it, if, especially if they do pay dividend. Now also the same article did also talk about, you know, the capital uh, spending which will reduce and he has dropped by minus 62 percent year on year so that's that's what really causing you know why there isn't much of contracts being awarded of course supply and demand okay but also take note of it the interesting uh story which cover is that analysts still have buy call and sell call so the buy call in here is server dynamics and dialogue all right sell call is on bumi amada sapura energy and velesto so you will probably know the direction of it those who don't know server dynamics also do the oil and gas a lot of contract or rig building and dialogue is basically is a storage facility so you know with the cheaper oil prices and where we have so much supply so dialogue will actually benefit why because people need to buy buckets <laughs> you know buckets of container but we call it all container and they are keeping it and some you don't know you know outside of uh, singapore you know they see so many tanker ships out there are those tanker ships storage for the ever reducing uh, all prices but some said no some said it is just that you don't, don't have place to park because Singapore ports are so busy on that one here okay 
so as we go on thank you thank you for those of you who are sharing if you have not shared this video please do so i really appreciate that as a gesture and gratitude to you too so i will work harder for you of course with smart roby now let's move on to our next story that we have for you in here is no other than property sector now the last two days uh star business been carrying the uh, very good undervalued stock which is uh, matrix uh, concept we talked about it yesterday again uh, the same sector mixed uh, property mixed review in here and given the post COVID-19 people are very tight with money isn't it I'm sure you guys are tight with money don't spend now you know but I do tell people look eat out to help out all right which is a motto that I try to do in and a lot of the small businesses are really suffering and if you can can do so just go out and eat out with your family and just to help out with the post COVID-19 we all have to do our share too so the story goes about the likelihood the sales uh, of the property will improve in Q3 if not Q4 on 2020 but if you have watched yesterday the news which was carried by Star Business talks about the uh, Dato Lee Tiam Hock which is the CEO Matrix right talks about how positive uh, that they are willing to hit yeah the uh, targeted profit of 1.1 billion sales for matrix concept even I haven't said that so, but some people did comment to me after that story and said that look you know some uh, in Suramban too you know things are pretty quiet out there it will be for a while before things pick up is that true or not those of you who are staying in Suramban what do you think is the the, the ac economic activity really moving up those of you staying in Suramban or maybe a bit on the south side or in Kajang or in Samanyet, all right, do let me know and type it in there. Uh, hi, Noria. Now, of course, those of you who are listening for the first time, just type one. So I do know how we can tailor our news here, our corporate headlines as well, Smart Robbie, just for you. Now, on this, uh, con uh, on this same chart, I just want to show you something, Matrix Concept, which I do like it. No, one of the reasons why I like it is because many of our listeners are slightly in the more senior upper level and they, they really want a dividend kind of stocks. And you all know that uh, we've been talking about fixed deposit being hitting very, very low. How low? 1.75 okay 1.75 of course the fixed deposit will be a bit lower in here but there will be another rate cuts uh, probably in september and october which i will talk about it, to 1.5 and next year we will revise this so if you've been watching smart roby i think some of you you will very stay very sharp because why you finally don't have to read newspaper i will read it for you and all the important facts that you keep updated now if you look at uh, uh this matrix let's take a look at a matrix whether it's up or not uh, still staying around 182 uh, we can look at the fund stock fundamental here right pretty solid rated uh, 6 out of 8 now also talk about yesterday public bank when I first spotted it it was only about 4 out of 8 ratings right but then you know there was around $16 $15 and then now we move back to 18 see what happens drop from 4 ratings to I think it was Two ratings or three ratings i can't remember you can check out uh, public bank so the same thing too as the news gather and more people realizing that the uh, property sector have some pickup or lease uh, with the case of metrics which you know they do have the very generous payout your pickup but having said that property sector right now everyone want to avoid you know having said that but then again that's what warren buffett say you will only want to be buying when there is what good news or bad news bad news isn't it so this is something those of you who have have a little bit small exposure i think it's pretty good um the intrinsic value is about four four ringgit right now it's only 182 definitely an upside 124 partly it's because of the pe of six times you know, generally that's something we have to be careful is this a real value trap or is this undervalued stock what do you think those of you especially in uh people who lives in Suramban and see those property in there give me your comments over there all right i really appreciate that okay now let's move on to our next story that we have for you here right it's no other than haha rubber glove that's right but so if you look at rubber glove continue to dominate what we've seen in the market and now one of the good stocks that hasn't run we which they talk about two stocks Previously, I think some of you got it and some of you actually contacted me was Comfort Glove and Rubber Rack. So remember all the big four. Now, if you have not, uh, those of you who are listening for the first time, did some of you think, go over to YouTube and watch some of the Rubber Glove sector talk that I have. Just go over to the playlist that have the special topics 
or the market outlook, you'll see there's one I talk about the four big four. Huh? Super glove, sorry, so, super glove pula. Top glove, super max, hata lega, okay, and kosan. Okay, so people are saying that no, all these four already fly, already, right? So what are the next two? So rubber X and comfort gloves, but they are not of the better quality eh, compared to the those big four. These are sold like kuchiret, kuchiret, sike, but has potential. Lah. So I think rubber X uh, started to make a move. We can look at rubber X right now, okay. Okay, let's move. We will look at rubber racks and we also look at uh, this comfort glove. So let's look at rubber rack stocks here. Okay, you can see rubber racks in here. Now that's nice, isn't it? Finally, if you can look from the chart here on the 5th of July, makes a green pentagon. So it looks pretty good to, to, to buy this, okay? Of course, the fundamental wouldn't, won't be good. Huh? So you're just more like trading this. But do take note the ASP. Uh, 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 why this thing is dominated is because of the ASP, which I'm going to talk about it. But as I said before, those of you who are buying rubber glove, take note of all the news that which is coming out from the uh, Bloomberg or coming out from CNN about the vaccine, vaccine, vaccine. Now, yesterday, Moderna, another one, has very good success uh, with the vaccine trial, uh, they tested on 45 people, very good uh, result, and there was not much adver uh, adverse effect. So they're going to move to a bigger population, which uh, Sinovac is doing that in Brazil too. So you see, as the vaccine price coming, uh, vaccine uh, news coming up in here, uh, you got the ASP price going up. So this is a, a slight conflict between them. But all in all, just be careful of the volume, the climatic volume that you see in a lot of stocks. Now, those of you, who study volume spread analysis uh, would know climatic volume usually means the market will U-turn. So that's why in Trade VSA we discuss all three factors: fundamentals, all right, very important. We want to know this good or not. We want to know the volume spread analysis, which is look at the volume and climatic actions, smart money, you know, they use media to trick you to buy, uh, okay, and finally news analytics. That's what we do. We feel that Trade VSA with Smart Robbie has the best combined analysis. That if you master this skill, my god, you have 50. 95 chance better than most people out there. All right. So if you look at Robberex doing pretty well, let's look at Comfort. Okay. Let's look at Comfort, which is the next stocks here. And we hit on to Comfort. Let's look at the uh, Comfort stocks here. Okay. Okay. Comfort also same kind of chart, isn't it? As a matter of fact, you really diff difficult to differentiate, right? They all move in tandem, rubber glove and, and so forth. So on this same news, uh, which is covered by also by CEO H, uh, they talk about the uniform trading pattern that sparked a lot of intrigue. Of course, like, these are all done smart money because as I said before, a lot of people are very dung dung one, no? You know, when they buy, they buy Supermax, they'll buy Top Glove, they all buy the same thing. But you have to understand, these are syndicate, these are not normal people. Normal people will generally will diversify out, but these are going in depth. They really hunt them, no? And they want to hunt them and shake you and wash you. And that's what we see. Of course, let's look at um, today, let's look at Top Glove. What is the stock price this morning, okay? And see whether hot, uh, Top Gloves had recovered from what it, we had yesterday, okay? And Top Glove is down 6% out there. Okay, so we are seeing uh, profit uh, taking coming in. Of course, the charts already tell you you got up trust and it start to move and just watch out for those red pentagon. Now, if you have, as I said before, uh, have bought recently on rubber glove, uh, you have to be very careful. And if you have bought much, much earlier, then it's good. But those of you who are thinking to buy uh, uh, rubber racks and comfort, just use the intraday chart, use the hourly chart like we see in TradingView and you want to go in for those one if you have not missed out too. I think there's a bit more run on those rubber racks and comfort. We have not seen it run. Again, the quality need to be there. But do take note of the vaccine news and it is. And if you don't like the kind of volatility, go for something else. Okay, we will look at some sectors. And to and tomorrow night, 9.30, there's another stock I'll be talking about. Maybe you want to take a look at that one. All right, let's move on to our... Uh, the headlines that this news is occupying is also the latest catalyst that really sparks this big movement is because of the ASP. Remember, an ASP in the context of Robert Club always refer to the average selling price because people are willing to pay 30 to 50% premium. Huh? Premium huh? because they don't want to wait. Remember, one of the topics we talk about in, in the uh, rubber glove is the long, long lead time. So take a look. Do watch that again if you don't not stay up to date. Now, one of the reasons why we do a lot of this video with very good content is to update the public, especially you, 
who are first time listening in here to get up into speed and don't make the dung dung mistake huh? don't make the stupid mistake that most public people come in and they listen here they listen there they buy kena toro toro so we don't want to do that we want to help you smart roby is there to help you with almost free at all and if you have benefit from smart roby do share this out with your friends share to five friends ten friends and make sure you get those credit too so the, the question also it turns on is how much is enough so let's look on to another sector which is advanced con for our next story now advanced con is a lot got to do with construction again it's pretty much a property play uh they, they are winning contracts because of the post covid that we see now no no choice uh, they have to you know they have to start back work isn't it i mean metrics are the start back work echo world massing you know uh, uem sunrise Summa Pumau Jalan Munya Munya Kerja. Okay, so Advanced Con in here came out with a very good report, uh, uh, clocking in about almost 20 million of contract from some Dhabi property in Bukit Raja in Klang. Okay, and uh, that's more like you know doing a bit of a construction in there. Uh, so the, the the news actually expanded further. Talks about they have a book order for 24 months, 722.3 million, which means the next two years they are profitable. Uh, sometimes business are like that. Uh, you know they don't know how much is it, so there are jobs to go out and win contracts and, and make sure people spend 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 so you know they will continue to build build more houses okay so that's that's where we are right now so okay so let's move on to our next story oh that doesn't matter we let's look at the chart first okay since this is advanced con we must look at the chart to see whether there is uh elements of property uh of uh profit taking in here Okay, now you all do know, uh, if you look from, okay, now you, if you notice this, the good news that this contract winning 20 million, in my opinion, must have come much, much earlier. Really, you can see this the 14th of June, you can see the climatic, uh, uh, what we call uh, confirm no demand. And you can see confirm no demand, then you have up trust the market break to the red pentagon. You can see red pentagon. So right now, this news, what do you think? Uh, not much isn't it all right not much of it by the time news comes out we're already too late so that's why it's important to really get in be before the news comes out which we will look at the next example here but let's look at the fundamental for advanced con now it's also important for you every morning if it, whatever i flashes out as a story of the day and this story i didn't make it up huh? right it is story comes from media newspaper like star business and also uh h uh, news uh, reporter they go out and cover and what we do is simply seeing whether there is an opportunity or no opportunity if there's opportunity we look at it and, and right now uh, what's presented is metrics it's not sexy it's not big headlines it's not tech and it's not rubber glove okay so if you look here uh, advanced con giving you a two out of eight uh, it does pay 1.5 percent dividend uh, it seems to be overpriced and overvalued so probably we just just going to skip it you know unless it's a technology kind of you know incline all right let's move on to our next story that we have here uh, Saucon, that's right. Now let's look at Saucon. And if you see Saucon, uh, quite interesting. This winning, uh, 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 or not so much winning a joint venture. Uh, joint venture, it's like one of those uh, MOU member. But you notice, uh, this joint venture interestingly comes out after the green pentagon that you see on the 5th of July, pushing up somewhere from almost 16 cent to 21 cent. That's a huge move, a 5 cent move, which is almost about 30% mark. So what does it mean? Now you see a bit of up trust and let's look at it today, this morning, uh, Saucon on the live stock price. And what is it telling you? Okay, it's still there and we can hit our trading view, takes it to our chart here. So we'll just wait for the charts to come out. Saucon, yep, well, still pretty much uh, there, not going anywhere. So again, very important just to analyze the news that we see here, right? And you can see there were no estimate given on the forecast sales. So it's more like marketing now. You know, they did a press conference. They call a few media and come in. Then they sit and then they, they you know buy you some uh, uh, probably some tea and coffee. Maybe not at the COVID now. They probably just do a press release and uh, Southcon Engineering has gathered a bit of attention on this premise. Okay, so let's move on to our next section that we have for you, right? Is 
no other than haha our premium alert our favorite premium alert that many members is looking to it and definitely one notable i was quite happy for many of our uh, fans out there who are watching the uh, smart roby was the omisti all right it came out pretty good uh, I think this morning also run. Let's look at Omisti. And and one take note that uh, every time when you go through that premium alert, okay, you want to look for the sectors. Very important to look at the sector. So if you see from the chart here, you can see right clearly it's our today's pick. You can see it's consumer product or it's a rubber glove. So those are the first thing that keep in mind. I'm training you, huh? Training you to look at sector analysis. Very important because many of those sifu out there, when they teach you, they're just pure technicals, right? They don't even look at sector. To me, a bit dum dum la, right? Or those pure fundamental ones don't look at charts, also die. Or they don't look at news. This is where a lot of public and those of you who just type number one, uh, means you're a beginner. You can now one. You must, because you are attracted by news. So news is the one that makes you want to buy, sell, buy, sell, buy, sell. The news, because it's news. Then you have to look at the fundamental, look at the technical. When you combine all these three angles, you will do well. So in here, oh Misty, when it first pops out, because it is first the leading indi indicator, you look at the technology. For so technology, you do it, and that's why it is so. Hard. So for yesterday pick, we have Nissin hasn't moved yet, it's down 2%. Uh, Kawan Food is still hanging there at zero. So we're going to come back and, and see whether uh, you want to have. So what you want to do, if you look at oh Misty, uh, uh, what did they do? Uh? I also don't know, so I'll check st stock fundamental too. So we can hit that one, takes us to oh Misty, just look at it uh disrupting convention okay so it means the technology lah <laughs> helping you to put business in order okay so what else do they do uh iot standard lah, cloud uh, uh, uh data services pretty much like trade vsa our company lah. a lot of technology that we use uh, it fintech to help your investment gets better omisti actify of course you can spend some time just click 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 and go through that but again it's technology driven very important to drive the stock price it's the story huh? the continued story that, that we have for here so omisti now let's move on to uh the uh kawan fruit uh, no 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 let's, let's move on to the stock take that we have for today okay so today we have uh kelly okay Okay, Kelly, which I did pick it early in the morning, 9.30. We will look at also another premium alert. Of course, I do recommend you guys to take the first one. Always be the best. Okay, let's look at the stock prices. Stock charts. Okay, very nice. You see, Kelly, right? This green pentagon on it. Chante, kan? Ah, chante. So let's look at the uh, stock price today. Uh, uh, what what do uh, green uh, Kelly do? Okay, uh, first thing I uh, check on Kelly. La. Usually sometime uh, the, the management uh, decided to do one. No. I, this one uh, is one of those uh, you know, uh, products. Then they say, hey, let's go to rubber glove or they make mask. La. Mask is the easiest. I uh, buy a few machine bag, get a few uh, what they call the, a raw material from China and they stitch, stitch, stitch. All right, then do a few things. Hey, look, look at that. You see, I say stitch, 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 right? They're stitching, isn't it, right? They got property. Oh, Kelly, they make women's one. So, <laughs> women's uh, undergarment can make masks. No? Can, isn't it? They just make masks. Counting, maybe the stock price will move up. I don't know. Again, speculating. Uh, because these days, people are looking for growth. And you see the condition. You can see it yourself, you know, in Bloomberg, and you see the TV behind me in here, every day, PPE, you know, Tachuko PPE, uh, uh, personal protection uh, equipment, so masks and all this. Uh, so once you go into that, whether do or not do, stock price go up, uh, right? So is that potential? We, we don't know, okay? Because their business technically are very boring, you know, go to golf course, property, you know, like property, I just explained, golf course, not many people also playing golf these days. Uh, everybody play e-sports, okay? So you can see PE is also zero. ROE is also negative. Not zero. Uh, negative means loss making. Uh, who knows? Huh? Again, this is a trading stock. So let's look at uh, Kelly this morning for the stock price. Okay. And it's up 1.3%. Let's look at the chart. Okay. Well, let's look at the price and the chart here using the trade VSA chart. Okay, and uh, okay, so nice, you can see, uh, green pentagon here, uh, continuation of uh, uptrend. 
All right, that's good. Now, if you some of you are really concerned, you know, should I buy when there's a red bar or not? That's something that I think it's up to you to skill up yourself. Right? Just like if those of you play games, like you say, hey, you know, I want to party some more. You want to add on your your skill level. Very similar what we do in our course. Of course, we also have our free stock analysis and stock review every night, nine thirty, except Wednesday. And this Thursday, we are debuting our also our coach, uh, which is uh, uh, this. Uh, Arif Thursday night, so I will talk a bit about tomorrow night too. Okay, let's look at the uh, next list that I have for you is our premium alert for the uh, ten thirty one ten o'clock. Got another list. Oh, Fran Ken, very nice technology, isn't it? Right, Kim Long. Oh, FP Group. Remember, we selected FP Group earlier one. Sudah pum 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 jalan juga. I can't remember what date, but definitely for our member session, uh, I will review this with you again now our member session on friday do take note that's uh, something oh five percent in here so again i'm uh, not eating not rocket science uh, any of the premium alert comes out technology driven team go for it if it's the first time and that's why it pays dividend to watch the premium alert uh, every morning in there right so let's look at it in here uh usually i don't try to select the stocks that i selected two weeks ago you know if you have it continue to run it if you if it comes out uh, uh then you want to pops up this is a nice one fp group you can see right uh, very similar to kub the first one that i picked and also the uh, comac remember comac uh they do a lot of the barcode stamping one you know the, the barcode like comac huh? you, you know like if you buy the the lazada or you buy the uh shopee they have those barcode system barcode solution they have so that one also going to ppe so found back again technology stocks uh took out of the uptrust remember you can see the uptrust ut very powerful make sure you learn those two okay so fg group looks pretty good front can i have that stock uh fg group hey oh misty also run versatile oh, versatile what they do a 4995 maybe let's look at versatile kim long is plantation i did talk about uh, plantation uh re recovery in her uh, and 7178 haha uh -huh. this one is a taiwanese company seven they pay pretty good dividend let's look at 7178 first all right and uh see whether the good fundamental or not okay if you good, good fundamental take a look at it okay fundamental uh, yeah only two only la, huh? but they pay 3.4 percent dividend uh you can see trading over value over price okay so means it's more for trading let's look at stock chart this one won't have so much um la, you can see but very nice you can see right long period of congestion here right in here is it ready to go up what do you think do you like this it's not going to be so exciting like omesti or kelly but i pick kelly all right but uh let's look at the one front can is nice but it's too much tech also la, sometimes huh? we don't want to pick too much tax uh in here ysp fg group omesti we pick that one eh? let's look at versatile 4995 again huh? industrial product what kind of industrial i think is it plastics again i'm not too sure so we can look at the uh company yeah let's look at stock fundamental first okay stock fundamental versatile uh vcb ah oh, loss making okay okay we just wait for the website to come out and now what did they do oh they have very standard factory isn't it versatile very versatile what they do oh this one now uh, it's more for packaging on uh, 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 box packaging smart resources uh, doing all this uh property Mm, no. okay they are global packaging supplier like uh, daibochi lah, innovative so what do you think let's look at the stock chart first okay and the stock chart looks good if not we will pick uh the uh just now the other one right oh eight percent in here very important is stock pick because for the premium alert we want to make sure you have a good stock pick we are moving up higher and faster too okay okay uh let's see this chart here versatile who look at that nice huh okay versatile is the one to go but if you look at the in terms of the uh at 31 cents so we'll pick versatile okay 4995 versatile okay so that's good so that's the two stock we'll pick and we're going to come back and review okay now um we there will be a short announcement also i'm just going to make a short announcement after this as we move on but let's go on to our next section too all right now the next section is no other than the i keep flashing this because some of you who are listening the first time you can see that uh, qr code take a photo of that one so you get 
training okay there's uh there's a short tutorial how to pick stock so make sure you get that train and how to get that uh very good win rates four tips only okay four tips all right next okay will be tomorrow's night at 9 30 360 degree view on revenue so we'll be starting revenue but hard so make sure you join me tomorrow and also bring your family members around or just share with your friends that this important uh, information i'll present to you a 360 degree view on revenue group and it's going to be great okay uh, i think some of you are pretty tricky yeah uh, yeah uh, already start buying revenue already uh, because you all know last week right when i start talking about what furniture then finally furniture move is it so don't push it uh, please uh. <laughs> don't push it okay let's look at see and see whether revenue is good or not then you decide all right uh, also this coming saturday will be uh, a preview to our master class which is the one we're doing in on sunday that's right uh saturday saturday that's right 18th of july make sure you check this out 2 p.m and there will be an invitation uh a click there just join our telegram chat group okay i'm going to show you telegram chat room uh, in the next slide then you know where to do so all right this is the telegram uh, chat room do join our best telegram chat room we have close to about five thousand already thank you thank you for all it's totally free and that's a qr code you can catch all of it or you can just join from there onwards also not forgetting uh just a short announcement we are moving to a new time slot right uh there won't be any today is wednesday right that's right there won't be any uh sorry today is uh wednesday that's right there won't be any uh uh, morning bell on Thursday the new time slot will be every Monday Wednesday and Friday so I'll be back on Friday so take note of that one I know some of you may not used to this but just take note I need to rest also la. <laughs> need to do some other things so my children and I hope you all understand that all right we'll do this but I will promise I'll be back every Monday Wednesday and Friday 10 15 and live at be techno I'll keep flashing this until you make note of it or you can watch some of those previous recording that we have so that's all I have for uh, today's smart Roby money talk breakfast show and I'll see you tonight at 9 30 all right if not on Friday thank you for watching bye bye